drink me up champagne and rosé. It's my game. Please fill my cup champagne. Okay. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel for another video. Am I too close to him? I don't know. Anyways, welcome back to my channel for another video. If you guys are new, my name is Sadie. So make sure that you are subscribed. Hit that bell notification. If you are already subscribed, thank you so much for coming back to my channel for another video. So today, y'all don't got no makeup. You see this is how I look on the regular schmegular. No makeup. But, and I don't have my nails done. I just took my nails off. I know what's going on. I'm just a mess. But I wanted to come on here. Y'all, this is really making me, like, go crazy because my head is cut out. So, one second. Good, good, good. So, I'm going to be doing a seafood boil. Um, My boyfriend has been begging me to make one of these. He's obsessed with seafood. So, uh, without further ado, let's get right into this video. So, um... I looked around for different like recipes and different things like that um, and just kind of like picking and choosing what I want to do with the flavor that I'm going for so let's let me just tell y'all the first few things that you need um, is some like pans like this we have some our own little ceramic pans but I don't think these pans are big enough so I want to use the longer pans so we got some butter we have some oil too Usually they use red potatoes, but we got some normal potatoes. I don't know why that's wet. We got some corn, some little baby corns right here. My boyfriend, he's been waiting all day. I was getting my hair done. So he's been waiting for me to come and cook this. So then we have dark brown sugar. We got some Cajun. What is this? Cajun, Louisiana Cajun sauce. Paprika. Minced garlic, y'all see that? Minced garlic, lemon pepper, y'all see? Y'all, I don't have nobody recording me. Then, got a pot of onion pie. Pie then. <laughs> then we got some old bay, cayenne pepper. Focus garlic powder, onion powder. So, those are all the seasonings that I'm going to use. Um, I like my stuff spicy, but my boyfriend likes his very, um, he likes his like, I don't know, what would you say? He likes his like mild. That's not me, but that's what he likes. So first things first, I'm just gonna get into putting my corn and my and my potatoes to boil to soften them up. So let's get right into that bit. So I got my corn in here. I'm about to boil that. I'm gonna turn the oven on. And for my potatoes, I just realized the big pot that I'm gonna actually I'm about to boil you my lobster in I don't want to um I don't want I don't want to put these in a the small pan so what I'm actually going to do is I'm gonna wrap them individually and then I'll just cut them up once they soften up my runners wrap to go ahead and wrap these and I'm just gonna I'm gonna use as a matter of fact let me use the kitchen scissors and I'm just gonna cut should I show you guys how I'm doing it when my boyfriend get back from the store I'm gonna have him like help me record because this is going to be a long video, and it's going to take long for food to be ready. So let me bring y'all to help a little bit. Y'all see? Hey, my beloved Liz. <laughs> so let me show y'all what I'm doing. Y'all, I'm so silly. So I'm putting it on this aluminum foil.
seafood oil is no joke this stuff is taking a minute to cook first i put it in the oven and then i just put it in a pot so i've been watching like three different videos so now it seems like it's coming along and let me show y'all one of the lobster tails uh oh you know see and then everything else is here in the pot i know it's a lot of water i hope i didn't use too much water and then i just got some more like, crab cakes since it's a seafood kind of night to hold me over until the actual food is ready. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys once I finish. I'm tired. I don't even cook for like an hour, but this has been a lot. So yeah, I'll talk to y'all once the food is finished for me. So y'all, I finished the seafood boy. That was the that was the finishing touch, but y'all, it it's not bad. <laughs> <laughs> But it could have been better. It's mm. not terrible. What you over there making all those spices for? What you over there eating it? What? <laughs> so, but it definitely could have been better. Like, I don't know. It's just like something was missing. Like, I don't know. But you know what? I, I learned a valuable lesson today. I learned a valuable lesson. I learned that I would be in seafood restaurants all the time and be like, they charging all of this. Where? Look at this. I'm like, they charging all of this. I could cook this, this, and that. But you know what I realized? Part of it is probably like the actual cook. And then it's actually probably the labor too because y'all cutting up them those lobster tails, like cutting the thing and opening up. It was a lot. Like, it was really a lot. Like, y'all, that's that. Cooking that meal is like a process, you get what I'm saying? So, it's very tedious. So, I learned a valuable lesson today. I won't ever make jokes to people no more saying, oh, I can make that. Now, I can still make crab legs because this is different. I didn't even have crab legs. But I can put some crab legs in the oven or on the stove. But, now nah, I can't. I, I, I'm going to learn how to make a seafood boil, though. Definitely now, I really, really want to learn it. Y'all, look at this place. What's a freaking lace? That's all I'm on there. So, yeah, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. If you guys know any good, easy, like, seafood boil videos, drop them in the comment box. Leave me their channel so I can go follow because I do want to learn. And I know my boyfriend probably want me to learn, too. So, yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video.